Welcome to the Afterspin, opinions from thought leaders in our state. We want to ask John Hood and Chris Fitzsimon at a recent East Carolina University football game, about a dozen members of the school's band marched out onto the field and took a knee when the national anthem was played. They kicked off a firestorm, a firestorm of conversation about their actions. What are your reactions to the protest and how it was handled by the university? John, I'll start with you. Tom, all students have the opportunity to express themselves on campus and even to protest in, in, in subject to time, place, and manner restrictions. But when you put a uniform on, whether it be in the marching band or the football team or whatever, you take on responsibilities that are different. You have to do, follow directions. And the students that protest, you know, students that are in the stands, fans that are in the stands, they don't even have to stand for the national, they don't have to do anything for the national anthem. There's no law that requires it. But if you're on the field in a uniform, you do what your director says. It's not a First Amendment question at that point. And I think those students were wrong and they were, they were properly called out for it. So how, how do you think the university's handled it? Well, fairly well. These, these uh, issues are, have actually become a lot muddier in recent years. What's the difference between freedom of speech and respect for other people's rights and so forth? This is actually, however, not that complicated. If you put on a uniform to, again, perform in a ballet, Essentially representing do anything the school. on behalf of the school, you are now subject to the direction of the people in charge of that team. And in this case, they didn't follow directions. Chris, what's your opinion of well, this? Well, I think it uh, was blown out of proportion. I think these kids uh, did, uh, college students are not kids anymore, they're adults. And I, I think they made a statement. Uh, you can criticize whether or not they should have done it in uniform or not doing it. I thought the governor overreacted about it. I, I was uh, dismayed that people were spitting at them and calling them all sorts of names, which I thought didn't reflect well on the student body. Of East Carolina. I actually thought the chancellor's statement was sort of uh, in the middle, uh, the new chancellor. Uh, I, I think that given everything that's going on in North Carolina, I was not uh, nearly as offended as a lot of people and, and thought that uh, this wasn't that big a deal. So uh, you're saying you thought the chancellor did a pretty good job? Well, I thought the chancellor seemed to play it straight down the middle, and I think, uh, but I was, I was disappointed by the reaction of a lot of the students and the reaction of the governor. All right. Well, thank you for watching the Afterspin. We'll have more video all during the week on ncspin.com.